The World Health Organization announced on Thursday that 49 people who have been in contact with a young Guinean girl who tested positive to the Ebola virus have so far been identified. WHO, we've assessed the risk of spread as high at that national level and across the African region, considering the porous borders and fragile health systems in the countries. The people are currently under isolation in their various homes. This comes after 58 others were discovered in Guinea on Wednesday. Since the outbreak of the Ebola in Ivory Coast, Many have been scrambling to get themselves vaccinated and the World Health Organization has pledged to support the country's health system with a good number of doses. 5,000 Ebola vaccine doses were sent to Cote d'Ivoire by Guinea, which receives the doses with support from WHO. Experts have been deployed to support the rollout. Vaccination of high-risk individuals started just 48 hours after the outbreak was declared. The WHO is also keeping an eye on neighboring Guinea, where a Mabu case was also detected last week. However, cross-border surveillance are being enhanced in neighboring countries to curb the spread of the virus.